Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. In tonight's video, we're gonna do a um, nighttime good night barn check on all the critters out there. Um, we've had two baby calves in the last week, so we're gonna go check on those, make sure they're okay, make sure mamas are okay, make sure the heifers in the barn are okay, make sure the goats in the barn are okay, make sure the goats outside are okay, and then make sure that all the other mamas that are out in the pasture are okay. This right now with us calving is kind of a nightly routine for us. Um, just going out every night before bed and just checking on everyone to make sure that everyone's good and that we're not gonna have any surprises through the night or in the morning, anything like that, just to make sure that they're all taken care of and snug, tucked in for bed and gonna have a good night. It's about eight o'clock right now, so let's go out. is the boys outside so they've got hay which I'm happy with water they have still got water in there um, it's actually fairly warm out hey buddy so I'm not super duper concerned tonight we've not had a lot of really cool nights recently um, that's a lie we've had cold nights um, but the last couple have been nice it's been a mild winter compared to what we're normally used to. Um, you can kind of see Fozzie in there. I just gave them fresh straw just a few days ago. They've kind of really like padded it down and messed it all up in there, but they do have a good layer of straw in there and they probably ate a lot of it, but everything out here checks out good so we keep walking the farm. <laughs> friends how's it going friends hey girlies oh there is still snow falling off the roof which is scaring everybody hello 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 everyone doing good everybody's doing good everybody looks good Bunsen you look good good boy perfect I can see you still got water in your bucket that's great nice and thawed you girls still have hay which I'm very happy about we used to well we still do we feed in these metal feeders but recently we've kind of just been putting a cut open bale on the outside of these cattle panels and it's been working really well and we've been wasting less so I'm really liking that because you know you know when you have goats like they just they eat for sport and they like to dig through it to get the pieces that they want and this way like I can keep pushing it up against the fence and pushing it up against the fence and then eventually I'll stick some in these feeders and then they get kind of like a different way to, to eat and they like that stimulation so then we really don't waste any and I really appreciate that. Okay girlies. Little girl. Oh Paigey look at you back there. He's just snuggled up. See if you got enough water. Yep, we got a full bucket of water. We're good with that. We're cool with that for the night. It's nice and warm in here. It's nice and cozy. Is you gonna have a good night? Is you gonna have a good night? Yeah, baby, you're gonna. She's a good girl. She's a good girl. Jazzy's a good girl too. Yeah. The goats are good. So now let's take a look at mama cows and see how mama and baby are. Hi, girls. Hey, sweet girls. Hey, mama. How are you and your baby? Your baby looks good back there. Looks good. I'm not gonna go down there because I can see that everything's fine. She's fine and baby's fine. Ears are up, I'm happy about that. I don't see any shivering. Mama is calm and mama has not really been chimbley, chimbley. Um, 
Mama has not been easy to work with. She has not been a really nice girl. She's been pretty steamy and sassy and throwing her head around and kind of charging at the panels in here and does not want anybody touching her baby, being by her baby. So I'm not gonna go and mess that up when they're all laying down. We are, however, gonna go in this pen with the heifers, check them out and check that mama back there out because she's got a calf. This sweet girl right here, this is Maple. She's out of Bell, one of our Jersey cows. She's a sweet girl, sweet girl. That red Hereford right there, Hereford. <laughs> Helen, the Hereford heifer, the other one with the tag. That's 517, she doesn't have a name. And then that girl right back there, that's Sprinkles. She's been throwing some sass lately and not really wanted to be a pet and not really interested in grain because when they get grain, they get pet. Everyone else is being cool about that, but Sprinkles ain't having it. She's throwing shit. Hey, mama. Hey, sweet girl, you're a nice girl. This mama was like a little testy, but nowhere near as testy as the other mama. And then her sweet babe's right back there. His name is Daryl. Daryl. Yeah, buddy, you're so cute. Everyone looks good out here. I'm very happy about it. Yeah, you look nice and cozy. Okay, I will leave. Okay, I'll leave. Okay. Well, I have upset the apple cart out here doing my check. And everyone is upset. That extra rusty, dusty panel in there, that's in there because she's not real nice that's to be real frank she is not nice and that's what we needed to be able to separate mama from baby when we were working in there earlier so i will leave you girls alone with your chilling i'll see you i'll see you in the morning maple girl you have a good night okay you have a good night and i'll bring you some snacks tomorrow maybe night helen bye babes Bye, babes. All right, everyone in the barn looks great. So now we just have to go shine the pasture to make sure there's no funny business going on out there because we're still gonna have more cows calve soon, soon-ish, um, just based on the cows that we bought. Um, we knew they were coming and really it's just a matter of when they come. So we're just gonna go shine out there really quick. We're not gonna go out there because I don't like to go out there without a spotter. That is just how I roll. So we're gonna just shine the field and see if there's anybody separated from the herd or anybody laying down that has been laying down a lot or showing any sort of like activity of possibly going into labor soon. So there's some mamas laying down over there. Everything looks good otherwise. I'm not really concerned. It's kind of hard to see with the camera, but in real life, what I'm seeing is not concerned. A lot of times when they calf, they like to go hang out down there. So the rest of the herd is up over here and that's where the buildings are and that's where everyone else is chilling. Everyone else looks really good up there. But what are you doing over there? Who are you even? That girl is by herself. And that, from this distance, really looks like one of the girls that we purchased that we don't know when she's gonna calf or when she could calf because that's just, you just don't know that stuff when you buy privately um, like we did um, off the, the type of sale that we did. So, oh boy, I don't know. We have to watch for a little bit. Or at least come out and check again in a little bit. So, thanks. All right, you guys, that's it for this video. That's about all there is to a nightly, like, good night check for all the animals. It's just going out there and making sure that everyone is okay, has what they need. That one mama cow makes me a little bit nervous, so I'll probably come out again in a little bit and just take a peek at her. But that's it. If you guys like this video, make sure you give it a big thumbs up, and I will see you next time.